Hey, what's up travelers? In this video, we're gonna head on over to Winway Walking Street and then over to Notre Dame Cathedral. You'll find some street food that you find here in Saigon. It's gonna be a little bit before we get there, but for you, it's gonna be just like that. All right, so we are here at Winway Walking Street. Uh, that's Uncle Ho in the People's City Hall behind me. Uh, there are a ton of people out and about here, uh, but let's go check to see what kind of cool street food we can grab. All right, so the first thing that we come across is a dish called man chang nung, which is a grilled rice paper. It's kind of like the Vietnamese cake on pizza. Uh, but yeah, I've never had it before, so let's check it out. So now we, we got this in hand. We got well, the bag is secured, so let's go sit down over here and uh, give it a try. So now we're sitting down here. We got our Ban Chang Nung here. Kind of looks like a taco. <laughs> Seems kind of like an interesting type of food, so let's give it a go. Huh? Mm. Yeah, that's, that's really good. So it's got like fried shallots and uh, maybe some, some dried chicken or something like that on it. And then uh, it's got some chili and some mayonnaise. And then, and then she put on a quail egg on there. Hmm. I've been missing out on this one for sure. This is this is awesome. Definitely, if you come into Saigon and you come down to Way Walking Street, definitely get yourself a grilled rice paper. Mm. Oh man, that is amazing! All right, let's just see what else we can find. Now we have found uh, street meatballs, uh, copy of Chen, and uh, yeah, let's get on to some of them. So we got some shrimp and some salmon roe balls and I think some some pork balls and some uh, chicken balls or, fi or fish balls, I'm not entirely sure. And then there's some, uh, some sauces there. It looks like a chili and I'm not entirely sure what that one is. I'll try one of these shrimp first. And we'll give it a dip in the sauce over here. Oh, 
<laughs> that's a kind of a surprise. I thought they were just actually going to be shrimp, but actually, what they are is they're 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 shredded shrimp that have been reformed to look like shrimp. Really, kind of interesting. They're very tasty, but it definitely wasn't the ex the texture I was expecting. All right, let's uh, try one of these. Uh, I think this is a fish ball. Might be pork. I'm not 100 percent sure. We'll dip it in that chili sauce here. Mm. Yeah, definitely a fish ball. Got a nice sponginess, springiness to it. Loaded with with uh, a really, really uh, nice, flavorful fish. Really good stuff. And then, kind of the the weird one out of the group here. This is a uh, this is a salmon roll ball. So it's actually got salmon eggs in it and uh, let's go so yeah basically what that is is a fish cake that's been it's been stuffed with salmon eggs and uh yeah it's, it's really good because you get that you get that uh, fish ball texture and then when you get into the middle of it you get these little kind of kind of explosions of the of the egg a little bit definitely definitely worth it this one i think is a beef ball yeah definitely what that is all right so let's go ahead and move on and go see what else we can get <laughs> well the police came uh, while i was eating that last bunch of food and uh, all this all the street food vendors they just disappeared so i guess we're just gonna have to head on over to the notre dame cathedral it's another place where everybody likes to gather around and eat street food at night here in saigon so let's go on, let's get on over there well here we are we are outside of the Notre Dame Cathedral, which is heavily under construction right now. Um, it's not looking too good for street food around here. Usually this place is absolutely packed and there's street vendors all over the place. But uh, know, we'll keep an eye out. So I made my way back over to Winway Walking Street uh, to see if the vendors had gotten back out. And I went and I found a, a fairly common street food called Bop Sale. Uh, it's uh, grilled corn with shallots and shrimp, and then uh, they also add some, some chili sauce in with it. And it is quite the little treat when you're around here. See, I'm digging into it. Oh yeah. And yeah, when they grill the corn like that, it gives it a really, a really unique kind of bouncy texture. And the little dried shrimp and, and the, the shallots just give it that, that perfect umami flavor. Definitely a pretty good thing to eat. You, know, you see these bikes around town all day long. They have their speakers blaring, advertising the bop sale. You see them with dried squid on the racks and everything like that. Which is another thing that they that they do. That seems to be served with, a, as the Filipinos would call it, balut. <laughs> so I just stay away from that idea. But yeah, this is definitely worth picking up. I think it's 
because I'm in here at Walking Street, it was a little bit overpriced, but then he wanted 50,000 down for it, which is just over $2. But uh, usually I think you can get it for about a dollar. Well, that was pretty good. Um, I think I, I've seen some interesting, it looks like the freeze-dried ice cream or something like that. They, they seem to have liquid nitrogen to keep it cold. So I'm not sure exactly what's going on with that. So we'll go find that. And, and I think that'll be the end of the video. But stick around, we'll go check that one out. Well, we found that ice cream. We're going to check this out. All right, so this was really, really unique. He <laughs> says the ice cream is just, just smoking. <laughs> How fun! <laughs> Yeah, it just kind of bubbles in your mouth. That's really, really cool. And definitely a fun experience. Ah. Awesome. <laughs> I would say that this is a great business opportunity for the states because this is something that I've never seen before. And it's legit fun. <laughs> What a great idea. All right, well, if you've enjoyed this video, go ahead, like, subscribe, hit that notification bell if you're into it, and uh, as always, eat great food.